I think you would say 80% of it was mugging up. So, 80% of it was never understood. Well, education for me would be something which uh, teaches you what, how to differentiate between what is right and wrong. The problem now is a lot of people don't have the courage to be different from the others. Education is something that is equal to knowledge. And education cannot be restricted to just books. Um, education is intellectual stimulation. <laughs> uh, it should be more oriented to what the individual wants. and. It, it should be such that uh, you're not stressing too much on marks and uh, grades and stuff. Meet Abhishek Fernandez. Very mediocre when it comes to academics. He doesn't want to know where the classroom is. He doesn't need to as well. He lets his car do all the talking. I wasn't, as usual, I wasn't you know, doing well in my studies. And my parents, up to now, are a bit you know, worried about that. And they don't want me to work, spend so much of time. Because when I, uh, the previous year when I spent time with this project, almost 80% of it was in the project. You know, the remaining of the, the little time left, I just spent with my studies. But then I I felt that when it comes to what I want in life, I've been spending enough time on, on that part of it. But unfortunately, because of the education system, it, it doesn't work that way. I'm happy from within that I, I kind of achieved. I used to always think that, you know, maybe one day I'll, I'll build a car and I'll I'll do something where I can make my parents proud. I used to think that I could know, build a company and then I was to, and I and I a first car comes out and, and dad would be there and stuff. And so in a way, uh, at this this in, in such early stages and when all all of this is came, and this comes together, you know, and you kind of have the same feeling that you know at least if not in the future, uh, if I may not get a chance to do something like that, at least for now, I. In a way, some part of my dreams have come true. Huh? He's always been obsessed with this notion of a car. And uh, I once, in, uh, when I was working, they asked about the family and I said, my son uh, has three interests, cars, cars and cars. I was not very keen on starting. Then I told him. I said, look, when you go into these things, you forget about these studies. So there's no project for you. You shouldn't be doing it. Previous semester, the first two tests, uh, I kind of got single digit numbers, you know. I hardly attended class. I may have attended barely two weeks of class the so whole you flunked semester. Now, basically. Yeah, so I flunked at the end. That's when my mommy got really upset. And then she kind of told my dad that, that he's encouraging me too much into this and you know, it's all because of him in a, in a way that, you know, I'm being misled. Education is a continuous process and it's an education for life. So you have to observe, you have to learn, you have to explore, you have to understand, you have to analyze, you have to interpret, you have to reason. 
Mr. Chandra Jain, Chancellor of the first deemed Jain University in the country, a class 8 dropout. He never believed in the education system. So, he invented his own style of education. I dreamt about to become an entrepreneur and I came out of the school. I didn't want to be in that classroom of four walls, rote learning, mugging up, which did not suit me. I didn't want to get educated because of my own reasons, but I wanted to create a platform for the future for the younger generation to empower themselves and become their own thinkers in the education. And then 95 I got into the system of that, what is the educational system in this country which was very outdated. It was rote learning of, of my previous experience. I wanted to break that ice. There are many other criteria. I say out of 100 basis points, I say one aspect is academics. Other 99 things may be conviction, confidence, exploration, concept, uh, compassion, love, values. We're just creating bookworms. Uh, you're forcing someone to mug and go climb the ladder. Like uh, if you look abroad, it's not the the environment is different. From a very early stage, you choose which line you're going into, and and then you you work on that. So by the time you reach the same level in a particular field, you, you have kind of mastered it.